Good afternoon, legends. Hope all is cool. Uh, normally, I film myself from an absolute Treckenhauser across the country to uh, interview someone. But today, I'm walking because I'm going down to Chelsea Training Ground to see Super Frank. And once uh, again, thank you so, so much for all your messages um, of support and also about the drinking and stuff. Um, how I look at it is honestly is the best policy. If you've got a problem, talk about it. That's one thing I do say, you have to talk about it. No point lying and kidding yourself. Talk about it, it's important. Right, let's go. And also people, thanks so much for all the questions. Um, I'm gonna get the interview done first and then afterwards I'm gonna answer your questions. Some really good ones this week, I really appreciate it. So I will be answering them after the interview. Got absolutely span spoozled back in the day and there. No more though, no more. I'm actually really, really nervous today. I'm lucky enough, I've met Frank loads and loads of times, but every time, because he's one of my heroes, him, JT, and the la 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 zola. So every time I meet him, I'm all a bit like, <laughs> And also, he's now Chelsea manager. <laughs> double, double. And here we are. A nice 12 and a half minute walk, and I've arrived at the training ground. Come on, the chefs. <laughs> Let's meet the team. Here they go. Here are the boys. Oh, I know, I thought it was feathers. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Tom Bassiano. Hey, hey, <laughs> How are you, Tommy B? Oh, yeah, you know, just lighting and uh, yeah. doing this, that, and the other. I've got a great story about Tom Bassiano. Didn't we once have a dance off in Nastia Chadley's front room? We did, we did. We danced till we couldn't dance anymore. <laughs> that was a great day. That you was a great day. He doesn't know about it yet. <laughs> Do you remember when his mum walked in? Yeah. <laughs> like, what, what you did? <laughs> she wanted to know if you wanted dinner, yeah, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. thank you, Tom. And this is Scotty D. What an absolute legend. How are you, mate? I'm good, mate. How are you? Very well. How's things? I'm You're good, uh, your hair slightly <laughs> matching mine now, brother. <laughs> right, said free. Yeah. Um, yeah, just want to say this man's a great man, a great cameraman, but he's also a great man because he helped me on and off the pitch, haven't you? I have, yeah. With the old, uh, we went on a tour of America and I was still getting the old cravings for the old alcohol. And this man saw me through it, so thank you. Yeah, I drank your beer. <laughs> <laughs> and look what they've done with this place. Look at that. The little sign there, camera's there. Come on, your hands. Training ground, not allowed to fill the training ground, but there, look at that. Don't say ever say that to me again, Scott. Here we go, beautiful. Neil Tibbetts asked me uh, that he remembers the dance-off in 2005, and if I've still got those moves, judge for yourself, Neil. <laughs> Would you reckon, Scotty, get him? <laughs> Good, my man. I wonder where you've been. I want you to come down and see us. How are you? You're you're right? Right? you good? Yeah, good, good. Excellent, mate. Yeah, great. Cheers. How are you? You well? Yeah, good. Oh, right, interview with Super Frank done. Um, what a man. I bloody, bloody love him. Uh, how did it go, guys? Really good. Top yeah. man as always. Yeah, he's cool, isn't he? Tommy B? Yeah, gentleman. Yeah. The football's good, guys. <laughs> right, now back to Sky Sports to edit it. Join me on my walk home. <laughs> Right, people, now time to answer some of your questions. Uh, Big King Bacon asked me, why the name Tubes? Um, bit of a weird story, really. Back in the day on Soccer AM, uh, I played a character called Peter the Test Tube Baby, which basically involved me dressing a nappy uh, with a can of beer, bizarrely enough, um, and a fake cigarette. Um, and I used to bring the balls out to the conga. Do 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 do. So Peter the test tube baby got shortened down to tubes. There you go. And here's a question for you guys. Um, comment down below and answer. Um, what's the best nickname one of your friends has got and why? But keep it clean, yeah? Cheers. Scott P asked, uh, was the heart attack uh, down to my drinking? 
Uh, the drinking definitely didn't help uh, because if you're downing bottles of vodka, clearly that's not good for your heart, let's be honest here. But it was actually, I had a hole in my heart. So when I gave up drinking, I needed a new addiction. So I started going to the gym and I lost my man boobs. Uh, my tits were in good shape and I was getting really quite fit. Um, but I kept going because I was addicted to it. So the blood was circulating more, I was getting caught in the hole and then that's what caused the heart attack. But obviously drinking and smoking did not help. Uh, so don't do it in excess basically. Charlie Graham asks, do I miss the old days with Soccer AM? Uh, a few years back, yes I did, uh, because I didn't think the show was that great and back in the day it was awesome. But since Fenner's came back and he's brought Darius the producer and obviously we've got Jimmy now, I think the show is top notch. I'm absolutely loving it. So currently I do not miss the old days of Soccer AM. So that's the end of the Super Frank Lampard vlog. Um, I hope you enjoyed and as always guys I really really appreciate all your support uh, give us a like um, and subscribe that would be awesome uh, big love see you later